purchased this uh, Salu Spa portable hot tub from Costco. We've unboxed it already. Um, I've never used one of these before, but we're gonna try it. This is what came in the box. I believe this is the cover, which is good. It's really thick, it's heavy duty material. I wasn't sure of the quality of this when we saw it because it's very in inexpensive. I think it's on sale for $350. Um, this is also a part of the cover here. And if you come over here, we have the pump, heater, and filtration unit. Um, we've taken it out, we haven't plugged it in yet. Uh, we have this. It's the forger that goes around the inflated part of the actual hot tub. And the inflated part is in here, and we're about to start inflating it. It says it's supposed to be inflated in five minutes. We'll see how that goes. But, uh, yeah, I mean, we wanted to get this because it's a fairly inexpensive hot tub. Okay, so after you've laid out these pieces, it says that the next thing that you're supposed to do is attach this little valve. This is a one-way air valve, so when you inflate it and then you pull the hose out, the air won't come back out. So you have to attach this to the inside. Inflating inlet here. It's actually labeled with a one, so that's good. So this just screws in. And then we can take this applied pipe and we can just put it inside this valve. Now at this point, you're supposed to plug in the pump unit and start inflating. Um, so we're going to get that plugged in start the inflation process. Alright, it's inflating. Actually going pretty quickly. inflating.
now the cover is inflated. That's good. Alright, next step is to disconnect the filler hose and connect the three hoses here directly to the pump. with water now and then we can turn it on and it can start the heating process. Okay. Alright, so the spa is almost filled up. If you take a look at the lines over here, you can see the, the min-max line. So we're going to fill it up to the max. Um, we've already turned on the heater. Once the water is passed, these two bottom inlets down here, you can start heating it up. Um, once we have the water filled up to the max line, we're gonna put the cover back on and just let it heat up. We're gonna probably try and get it to about 100 degrees to start and then we'll try it out. Guys, the spot works. <laughs> 